Hi there, my name is Raymond. Today I would like to talk about some super important Redbubble tips for beginners regarding making beautiful designs that sell well. So if you are a new P on Redbubble specifically and in print on the bond business in general, for sure this video would help you a lot. And hence, if you are new in my channel, I would appreciate it if you like this video and subscribe now not to miss further tips and tricks for making money online in many fields like print on demand and affiliate marketing and others and today to be straight to the point i will make my talk a proof based one so i will show you one of my beautiful designs that sell well on redbubble and apply all tips i will talk about on it and now let's jump into pc to see this a sale message from redbubble hi Raymond, congratulations on your recent sale on redbubble the customer is in Australia and the design I will talk about today is a baseball cap of Pernese Mountain Dog Lovers and for better look on this design here it is so now the first Redbubble tip for beginners for making beautiful designs that sell well is the niche choice okay as a beginner it's better for you not to enter the huge and general niches because your designs will be period and drawn among millions of designs as a result you will not get sales by organic search easily and then instead of that you can going through uh, some niches with lower competition and there are two options for doing that the first one is by niching down or going through sub niches or micro niches from the original niche i will give you an example if you want to make designs about coffee you can make sub niches or you can go through sub niches or micro niches from coffee like latte uh, cappuccino nescafe uh, mocha designs and so on if you want to make designs about mother you can specify on some niches or sub niches like mother to be the second option is by cross niching in one design which means you can make one design that combines two huge niche in the same design like cats and summer dog and pox and coffee and pox and so on and hence in our design today it's about a pernese mountain dog i love my pernese dog and it is a type of dogs and clearly it is a sub niche from the big general niche that is a dog niche so to make designs that easily search it and rank it high on search results, go and make designs about sub niche or cross niches, which means you can make designs about niches with lower competition. Okay, so as a first step today, it is the choice of your niche. And the second red bubble tip for beginners is the type of your design. If you have a solid skills regarding graphic design and using the professional softwares like Photoshop and Illustrator, it's very nice. But if you don't, don't stop, don't limit yourself because you can make outstanding text based designs. Yes, and believe me, they are well sold on all platforms including Redbubble. Like our design today, this is a text design, not a complicated one. And if you want to make this beautiful such designs i recommend you using two applications on your phone the first one is called pixel lab and the second one is a type image so we will go to the first application pixel lab we will use this application for just making a transparent background for our designs okay like this one we will delete this design okay and it is a transparent background just you can save it save as image okay save to gallery okay so we are coming here to the next application the type image and here we can change this photo by our a uh, transparent background like this okay okay gallery our transparent like this and uh, double click on this text okay and here we can type any uh, sayings or any quote about your sub niche or cross niche as i said before 
Like I love Pernese Mountain Dog. Okay. We leave this. Done. And we are going to this a letter for making a different types of typography for this design. You can make by this application hundreds of the same design but different forms like this one as you see many beautiful typography for this design okay and when you are happy with this design as an example you can just make any effects on it like changing color okay by a palette like this one and so on so you can colorize any part of this design as you want by choosing one of them and you can move it like that okay and you can make it a color like this one or this one okay that's it done and go for this saving save to photo gallery and hula you have a beautiful design and therefore as you can see you can make beautiful text piece designs that would sell well and attract many people who love pernese dog or whatever your designs talk about and to jump quickly to the third redbubble tips for beginners it is the redbubble products or redbubble items yes if you want to not to lose any sales in redbubble of your designs you have to make activation for all Redbubble products, all Redbubble items, beginning with t-shirts and line dresses and home decor items like short curtains and the path mat and the stickers. You can make activation for all items as possible as you can because you don't know which product your customer needs or which item your customer loves your design on. Okay. And in our case and in our design today about Pernese Mountain Dog, they design on a baseball cap, not a normal t-shirt. So you can enable all products, especially stickers, because it is the most frequent sold items on Redbubble. Okay, and finally, in this video, you have got three important Redbubble tips for beginners. By choice, good niche, uh, sub niche, or cross niche, you can make text-based designs and you can make activation for all Redbubble products. I hope you enjoyed this video and I appreciate it if you like this video and subscribe to my channel now for more tips and tricks about making money in many fields like POD and affiliate marketing and others. And if you have any questions, you can leave it in the comment section. See you in the next video and goodbye.